Hi YouTube, I'm back. Back in the living room, because again it's better lighting, but it's funny, the lighting in the living room is um, technically better, but I also look like a corpse. Interesting how lighting works, isn't it? Today I am going to do my makeup, and that's it. I don't particularly have a plan, but I was like, you know, I'll film just me doing my makeup, you know? Because I was like, oh, no one wants to see just a boring, like, get ready with me. And I was like, well, it's better than just not filming it, I guess. Some people will be interested. But yeah, we're going to do... I'm going to a dinner party tonight. It is currently 2pm. But I would literally rather do my makeup right now than do it without natural lighting. Do my makeup without natural lighting freaks me out. I hate it. So we're going to take the Milk Makeup Grip Primer. And I'm just gonna put it everywhere I feel needs to be gripped. Putting on my uh, Too Faced Hangover Pillow Balm, as I said in the last video. This is a lip treatment, but my lips are so dry that I use it as lip balm. And I'm going to take my Pro Fusion Feel Good Skin Longwear Skin Perfector in Cool, cool Pink, Fair 3 Cool Pink. Um, yeah, so this is kind of like, it's not my everyday makeup, because I wouldn't do this every day, do you know what I mean? Um, it's a bit fancier than everyday, but it's also not too much, because it's not like, ugh, it's just a dinner party, I'm not trying to look fancy, but it's like, I feel like sometimes I compensate with my makeup, like, I never usually dress fancy, sometimes I'll dress... I don't know, it's never fancy, do you know what I mean? So, I don't think I'm expected to dress, dress fancy, but I always feel better if I've got really nice makeup and kind of casual clothing. It kind of makes up for it, in a way. <laughs> I'm still not 100% sure of the texture of this foundation, to be honest, but sometimes I need to remember it's also just like mask and texture that is the problem. Take my beauty blender. It's like, I bought this thinking it was a normal beauty blender, but it's like a weird porous one that I think is meant to mattify your skin. Um. I find it kind of useless, I'm not going to lie, but it's good for like, like picking up kind of heavy bits of foundation. I don't know. I'm taking the Naked Quickie and 20NN, the Naked Quickie concealer even. Um, Yeah, I'll probably just call this video like, get ready with me, I guess. Or... Maybe I'll clickbait, I won't clickbait in a hot minute. I remember everyone hated me once. Cause I am... Um... <laughs> in my defense I was like 18. But I like made the before and the thumbnail like me with a edited big nose. Like abnormally big. Um, and everyone got really annoyed at me. But I don't think there was a normal person that had a nose that looked like that. So I don't know why everyone was really annoyed at me. but. I won't be doing that again. Yeah, maybe I could do a bit of clickbait. You'll never believe this transformation. Cut to me just doing my everyday makeup. Um, I'm taking the Fenty Contour Stick in Amber 01, as usual. Put it here. Here. I like to put it up here. We're gonna go all, oh. I'm gonna go all around my head just in case I wear my hair out of my face, but I probably won't, let's be honest. I never do. Uh, on the nose. Not up there though. <laughs> right, it's, it's going wrong on the nose, but it's fine. Yeah, I've taken my extensions out. I'm getting them put back in uh, in a couple days. I just like to take them out so I can, my scalp can get a break, do you know what I mean? But, um, yeah, I think I'll put them back in for like Christmas, New Year, and then maybe change it up a bit. I'm kind of doing the routine I did for the Queen Girl, but I'm taking the Oh Soul Mio. Oh my God, I've just got bronzer all over me. Get, look, I'm just going to take a little blob. I'm also getting my nails done after a get my extensions put back in. So, 
have a nice little glow up. See, I'm a nail biter, so getting my nails in this kind of necessity to stop me biting my nails. I feel like it's less about looking cute <laughs> at this point. It's just so I can stop bloody biting my nails and picking at my skin and all that. I'm gonna go straight in with blush. Oh my god, bronzer is all over my makeup bag. Ah. So I'm taking, I usually is not bronzer all over it. I'm taking the Morphe to Wonder Tint Cheek and Lip Miss Tint and FYP. Very trendy off them. This is, I always find this kind of hard to work with. I don't, because it's such a little tiny pot, look. It's like, so I'm just going to stick my brush in and hope for the best. I like it. It's quite subtle. Very rosy. I'm going to take it up here as well. Something 19 year old me would do but occasionally still looks very cute I think. Like right under the eye here. And then I'm going to take so I've still got, see, sitting in the living room, it's so freaking cold. I don't have double glazing, so I'm sitting right by the window right now, and it's just freezing. So I think I'm going to do some freckles, not too much. Taking the Morphe 2 thingy majiggy and a hint of espresso. And take a little bit on my Kirby grit. And just dot it around the nose. I also think my nose is like constantly runny because um my dog just sheds and sheds and sheds and sheds. And I'm not allergic to dogs, but I think probably just living around that much animal hair will do it. Right, I think I'm gonna keep it. No, actually, I'll put a little bit. Sometimes put it up here, but I actually think I want to keep it to this part of my face. I'm actually just going to do that a little bit to make them just a tad lighter. I'm going to take my NARS translucent powder and crystal light reflecting setting powder. Let's put, okay, I need to stop reading the whole thing. I'm just going to mattify my face. Always make sure to powder my eyelids because they crease so easily. Uh, I'm taking the Urban Decay 24-7 Inks Eyeliner in Whiskey, so this is brown. And I'm going to do my beauty spots with this because I kind of want them to be a bit more prominent. one here. I'm gonna put one here. 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 And eyebrows. I'm gonna take the Rare Beauty Brow Harmony pencil again. I'm taking the gel and cool brown and I'm just gonna Also, quickly, if anyone is curious, these earrings are from Regal Rose. They're gifted, although I'm doing an ad for them on my Instagram, so I don't know what I say. Yeah, it's a gifted, because this is not an ad. Um, <laughs> common sense would be a good thing that I could use sometimes. So I'm going to take my NYX brow tint pen in black. I'm just gonna I've grown out my eyebrows as you can kind of tell, so I've been kind of struggling with doing them lately. Hopefully you saw that. Uh, I'm going to take a little spoolie and kind of blur that out just a tad. Taking a little angular brush, I'm going to take the Venus XL palette 
um, and I'm gonna take Botticelli, that's gone, <laughs> and um, just run it through my brows so it kind of matches my hair a little more. They're a bit blocky, so I'm just gonna do that again. That'll do, I hate doing my eyebrows. Yeah. I'm gonna take a little bit of concealer and clean them up quickly. I'm not happy with my eyebrows, but I'm never happy with my eyebrows. Taking the Urban Decay 24 hour eyeliner in black. So we're going more straight up. Usually I kind of go that way. Braving it, apparently. Okay, so we've got some questionable eyeliner. We're going to add quite a lot of black eyeshadow to smoke it out. Actually, first I'm just going to take the ColourPop um, blush in Meow. I'm just taking a little bit and brightening up that blush ever so slightly. Not too much though. Uh, I'm actually going to take the ColourPop palette in Rock Candy. Um, this isn't an ad for ColourPop by the way. <laughs> I just like their eyeshadow. Um, I'm taking the shade I Dig You. And I'm going to actually do that with that. I'm going to put it right above. So it kind of has something for the black to blend into. I'll bring you in a tad. I'm actually going to take this tiny little brush and put the shade Hot Spot, which is black. Blur it out. Like so. I'm so ass at eyeshadow, honestly. <laughs> it's okay if it's a little messy because you know how we're going to save this. Sorry, my dog is drinking a lot of water in the background. Um, we're going to save it by putting a big lash on. I'm going to do a uh, inner corner. The Kaleidos, uh, Kaleidos Symphony Contour Trio and Fair, and I'm going to take the middle shade and just contour my nose a little more. And I'm going to add some Thrill Seeker Rimmel Mascara to only the top lashes though. If you watch my last video you'll know my whole reasoning for sometimes not putting mascara on the bottom lashes. I just sometimes think it makes you look a bit fresher. I don't know why. Right, let me go and find these lashes. Okay, so I'm just waiting for the lashes to get tacky but I'm going to take Blind Crime Lid Light and Airy my old trusty and this might go terribly wrong but I'm just going to take a little bit of my finger and put it up here I'm taking a little bit on my flat brush as well and just going to go sorry give it a little lick you don't have to do that uh... <laughs> that's the way I just got embarrassed that I've just found myself licking my brush uh, it helps though, and I'm just going to take it all the way under. Mm. 
like that. Really brightens up the eyeballs. Look at that. Now I'm gonna attempt to put on these lashes. Wash my bloody look. No, I don't know what lashes they are. Oh, that looks a bit wrong. I don't know what lashes they are. I'm so sorry. See, I do such a thick eyeliner when I put on lashes like this because the band is so thick that it's so easy for it to just ping up. But if your eyeliner's thick enough and it pings, it's not as noticeable. You see? I'm taking my little trusty Lime Crime lip liner and toe past. Um, and as I said before, I'm pretty sure this is discontinued, but Get Cool BFF by Colourpop it's, was my favourite lip liner ever. I haven't got it since it ran out because it's like, a th it's expensive to ship, I think, so I've just been using this, but um, that's your dupe. There you go. But Lime Crime, if you see this, bring it back. Taking the same cheek and lip mousse. Oh, I'm getting bronzer all over me again. Um, and I'm going to take that on the center. Sticking to what I know, taking Tasty Hazel by Gucci Beauty and going in to darken this lip up slightly. Okay, we're overlining a <laughs> more than maybe I should, but that's fine. Yeah, there we go, that's a bit better. And now I'm going to take the Kaleidos Ray Rider Highlighter and Space Age. It's just like a neutral shimmery highlight, and they'll do. Because I don't think they make this anymore either. Sorry about that, but. And put some way up at the Clarissa under the eyebrow and a little bit on the cheeks not too much and I think that's it well not really I need to do my hair Urban Decay All Night are set in spray um, the lighting is so terrible in my room. I don't know if I can even... I've also lost my tripod, so I don't know how to show you. Basically, okay, I can't... This is not ideal, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to take every part of my hair, I'm going to do that, and I'm going to flick it up like that, okay? You don't need to know anymore. It's as simple as that, guys. Okay, so this is the finished look. I had to pin my fringe back. Not happy about it, but my hair's just giving me the run around because I've not got my extensions and I'm confused by it now. I've got a simple brain. I can only deal with so much, you know. But yeah, this is it. I'm not going to get dressed yet because it's 3pm and it's not till 7. So, <laughs> be a bit weird. Not that I'm going to wear anything fancy, that I'm probably going to wear a jumper, but uh, I'm really simple, surprisingly easy. Um, just smoke out a wing. But yeah, I think it turned out quite cute. It's um, not too much. Well, that might be a lot to some people, but not to me. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate the love. Um, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. I'll be more creative than this, probably. Maybe not, no. I'm not promising anything. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you liked it. Bye, love you. Bye.